These are like the batteries that we took out from last time. I'm just gonna take one from the stack, put it on the table. Open the case up, ensure that there is no damage to the plastic cover. At this point, you wanna be sure not to set any metal objects like your ring, your watch, your screwdriver on the current collector as you may cause a short. To remove the BMS board, first pull the center pin, which allows you to remove the base pin, then allowing you to remove the BMS board. I'm gonna remove that. Careful not to pull on the BMS wires from the plug or module as they will disconnect easily. Install our EV West battery management system board utilizing the same Tesla lock pins, a couple wires that plug in in the back. There are three revisions on the BMS board for a Tesla module, A, B, and C. You need to ensure that you have the correct board for the module that you're working on. See product page on our website for more information to determine the revision of your Tesla module. When we reinstall the pins, first we will place the base pin into the board, then we will secure that by placing the small pin in the center. And close the lid. Now we will install this Kapton tape to secure the lid. From there we test it using that little BMS tester. At this point we'll use our BMS tester to ensure that all cells are reported. And write down the cell voltages on that sticker. sticker here and it's ready for sale to the customer. Right. Voila.